guys, it's Terry. Welcome to my channel. Um, today I have a fun box that came in. It's called Awakening in a Box. And it's all centered around crystals and stones. So I'm going to show you that. Um, it's been a day, so you can kind of see outside. It is dreary and cold out today. Um, and I came home and the house was freezing. It had, um, somebody had put the air conditioning on. I'm like, seriously, people? So anyway let me see where i'm hold on okay sorry i'm trying to see where my camera is on here because I, I got the phone the wrong way but anyway um so i came home the air conditioning's on it's freaking cold in the house it's like an ice cube in here it's cold and miserable out there and um but i came home to a ton of mail so my bless box came in my awakening in a box came in and i got some miscellaneous clothing, I think, that came in from some boutiques. So we're going to go through the Awakening in a Box to start with. It looks like, they usually send me three crystals, and it does look like it is, I don't know if I showed you the inside, so it's all green. Looks like a kind of a St. Patty's theme or something. So let's see here. So here are my, looks like I got a big chunk of quartz. Here are my crystals. I'm gonna look and see what crystals we got. And there is like a little card for each crystal. And then, that's the artwork for this month. It's kinda scary. She's, I can see, whatever this is, she's got crystals all around her. I don't know what this is, so we're gonna read that. There's a note from the curator. Looks like there is a bath bomb. Super excited about that, and something else at the bottom here. I don't know what this is, so we'll discover what all this is together. Okay, so it says, Welcome to the February Awakening Box, Heart Chakra. This, can you hear my dog? Nitro, can you stop it? He's like rolling around on his back, snorting, just for no reason. Okay, so this is a one-time limited... He's not going to stop. He's going to talk the whole time I'm talking. Um, this is a one-time limited edition box. It contains three crystals or minerals that are vibrationally aligned to help you learn how to accept and express love in all its forms. It makes sense for February. Also in your box is a gorgeous hand-carved rosewood box. This can be used to hold resin, incense, jewelry, crystal grid stones, inspiring notes, etc. You'll find a sublime heart chakra bath bomb to help you relax and soften into your inner heart center. Find us on Facebook, Instagram for tips on meditating with your crystals and inviting their abundant energy into your life. This note doubles as an art print drawn by our art director, Eli Valorosa. Follow his Instagram to see more of his art. We would like you to, again for being a seeker of truth and enlightenment, of course being part of our awakening in a box. So that's today. So let's start with our stones. We have received mangano pink calcite unikite and asterite serpentine okay so let's see i think that's what these are so let's see what let's look at their little bag i think i thought something was quartz but it's not oh it's and it is kind of pink okay so this is the pink calcite i'm gonna open this up and show you so you can see it it's quite a big stone. Okay. It kind of does look like a milky white, but it is, a, it's got a little bit of a pale pink. It is hard to see that, but um, maybe if I put it up against a white, no, it still looks white, doesn't it? It's a little pink. I don't know if you guys can see the pink, but it is a little bit pink. I think you can kind of see it. Okay, so let's see what this says. Um, and it says, say this every time you use your stone, love is my guiding truth. May Mangano calcite enhances the flow of energy from the crown chakra down to the heart chakra. It can attract new opportunities for you to learn the concept of universal love. It's also a useful so stone for healers to have, which allows in the healing vibrations to travel to the right location on the client, and this is for the heart chakra and zodiac sign Cancer, Libra, and Taurus. All right, so that is the pink calcite. Um, it's so big. Let me see if I can get it back in this little bag because I'm afraid if I take these stones out of the bag, I'm not going to remember what stone is what because I'm still learning about all the different stones. Okay, so the next one I have is Asterite Serpentine. This is like green with some black. Hey, you guys can go outside. 
No, you're not taking the toy outside. Sorry, guys. I should know better to do these right when I get home, but this is the only time that like nobody's at the house and it's kind of quiet. So anyway, um, all right, so let's put this one down here and let's look at this pretty stone, this pretty green serpentine stone. So I wanna show you that. Uh-oh, it fell in my box. All right. That's pretty. There's the back. All right, so let's see what this means. This one is the affirmation you say when you hold this is, I am fulfill fulfilling my heart's desire. Serpentine can be used to attract what you want most in your life, including abundance on all levels, prosperity, love, and healing. It aligns your intent with the heart chakra and source energy. Serpentine is known to form a unique connection to promote healing in the way that is best for each individual. Aligns with the heart and crown chakras and zodiac sign Gemini. So that is what this little baby does. Or means. Or means and does. I think this is so interesting. You know, like ancient healers and stuff used to use these crystals. And that's really neat. All right. The next one is Unikite. The affirmation you say is, my heart chakra is empowered by love. This is a neat stone, too. It's really cool. It's like pink and green. Can you guys see that? I'll show you the other side. So it's pretty pink and green. And it says, Unikite helps balance your emotions. Oh, I need lots of these. <laughs> yes, my emotions are all over the place. All right. Unikite um, balances your emotions and aligns your spirit with universal, universal consciousness. Unikite is a gentle action of sending out peaceful vibes to those nearby. It can be useful at work or home, sending out calming energies into the environment. Meditate with Unikite on the third eye to bring knowledge in from the higher self of the heart chakra for understanding and implementation. Aligns with heart and third eye chakra, zodiac sign, Scorpio. That's what my boyfriend is. Scorpio. So, so is my daughter, and now so is my grandchild. So, so weird. I got three Scorpios in my life. And if you have ever uh, been with a Scorpio, they can be a little stubborn. All right, so let's see here. So then we also got this little box. It's a little rose. I think they said it was a rosewood box. It's really cute. It's got like gold on the side. How's it open? I don't want to break it. Okay. <laughs> I guess you could put your little stones in here or jewelry, it said. It's very, very, very cute. And it's got neat little pretty detailing cutouts. Um, what did this say this was? Hand carved rosewood box. Hold resin, incense, jewelry, crystal, or stones or notes. So that's cute. That's just like a little cutesy little box. And then I got the bath bomb, which is heart chakra bath bomb to help you relax and soften your heart center. I wish it said what was in this bath bomb. I can kind of smell it. And I smell lavender, which makes sense. It's kind of, I don't know if you guys can see the colors. It's green. It's like a light green color. I know that's not the best lighting, but yeah. So that is my awakening in a box. So we got three fun stones. This the bath bomb, and I really love learning about these stones. So I'm gonna actually put the meanings on the stones back in here. Um, and I get one of these every single month. So this is a ton of fun. I just like learning about the crystals. I actually almost went crystal hunting Saturday. I was thinking we have a place by our house, a mine, where you can go and uh, mine for your own crystals. I almost did it, um, and we ran out of time or something. I don't know what happened. We didn't get to do it. So we've done it once before. So anyway, um, next time I do that, I will take you guys along with me. I'll vlog and do some videos and then come back and show you the different types of crystals that we do find from that. So that is my awakening in a box. Um, I don't know if I have a link or not. I'll take a look. And if I do, I will put the link below so you guys can take a look at this. This was through Crate Joy. Um, I'll see if I do have one. I might. And then also I have a blessed box that came in. So I'm excited to see what's in that. So stay tuned. That's coming up next.